in this sack here. Okay. Got a little orphan. Oh. <laughs> Her name's Sarah. She's a gorgeous little common wombat. If you'd like to have a stripe, she feel free to do so. She's pretty friendly. But she's quite coarse fur. She's a little digger, so she dwells under the ground. But it's in the name. She's common. So she's found around Tasmania, all different regions and places you'll find wombats. They're the only type of wombat you'll find in Tassie. This little one, she's about nine months old. So she's a gorgeous little thing. And the reason she's sadly here is not free breeding, so they're common. She's actually an orphan. So mum was hit by a car and she was found by the roadside. So that was just up the road here. And these little guys, they change in colour as to where they come from. So she's an East Coast wombat. She's more grey in coloration. We've got George Clooney over there, who Chris is about to get out as well. So he's more grey as well. That's how he gets his name. He's got a silver coat on him. But the further up north you go in Tassie, they tend more of a brown in coloration. So Cradle Mountain has some quite brown wombats. And they're very friendly up there. So that's the best place to see them. But this gorgeous little lady, you can see she's very sleepy. She's got a pouch, but she wouldn't be sleeping in mum's pouch. Mum would say, no, you don't fit in there. So we give her the pouch as a little comforter. Because these guys spend an awful long time with mum. About 18 months to two years with money. So it's a very long time when you compare it to devils and quolls. About eight months or so. Those kangaroos, very similar, 18 months. But where she'd be is up in underground. So during the day, she's fast asleep. And they build complex burrows and she'd sleep with her mum in this den. These guys, we often get asked why are they solitary, why are they not with friends? These guys like their own company, but they're a bit of a recluse. They love their own little personal space. And so, she would be with mum. That's what the pouch is for. So it makes her feel safe and comfortable. We'd love to cuddle Sarah all day long, but sadly it's just not possible, is it? But a gorgeous little thing. She may look like another type of animal you'll see around mainland Australia, the koala. They have closer relatives and they are the hairy nosed wombat, southern and northern on mainland Australia. But you've also got another relative, the koala, very distantly nowadays. But you can see they look very similar. So she's got that little leathery nose. That's actually a wombat's main sense, is their sense of smell. You can see they've got very small eyes. They don't really rely on that, like those devils. And tiny hairy ears. So this is when they're digging in the underground. They're not going to get all dirt in those ears.